What up, though, Warriors? I just wanted to come and do a quick little update on where I'm at mentally and physically. Um, physically, today has been on and off. Um, I want to say my body needs a tune-up. You know how your car just go, 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 and boom, it cut off? Go, 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 boom, it cut off? That has been me today. It's like my body is short-circuiting. That's the only way I can describe this. It's like it's a short circuit going on, and it's hitting in my spinal cord. Did make me a doctor's appointment, so I'm waiting to go into my neurologist and my regular physician to discuss it with them with what I feel like is going on with my body. But mentally, um, I'm in a good place. I'm not in a bad place. I'm doing these shorts, but I'm also feeling like... Um, it's keeping my mind off of, you know, what's going on. Because when I have those feelings and I'm about to lose balance or I feel like I'm about to fall through the floor, that sparks my anxiety, which sparks panic, which causes me to feel like I'm having a heart attack. And then that caused me to be down or at the hospital. So to avoid all that, I've been just trying to keep my mind really, really busy. Also, I had like a little short snippet that I had put on my page and I ended up sending it to a couple of family members because when I was first diagnosed with MS, none of my family knew about this. They didn't know. They didn't know I laid in the bed for six days, in the hospital for six days. They didn't know that I was unable to walk. They didn't know that I was falling over. They didn't know. Nobody knew. Nobody could know. You know, I want y'all so y'all can know what all I've been through and what all God has brought me through. It's not me. It's not my doing. It's truly my faith in my health. I got faith in my health like never before. I don't have that faith in my finances. I don't have that faith in the people that surround me. I have faith in health, like without a doubt, you know, and even when it gets um, shaky, I still be like, okay, Lord, give me the mindset to get through. I don't even want to think what I'm going to get through. I just need the mindset to get through. So I just want to come to y'all and let y'all know, no matter what you're going through, no matter what the situation is, it do turn around. It turns around. Me and my kids was left, okay? Left living off 160 a month, my son's child support. We were left without a car. It was stolen. I'm not going to say who it was stolen by at this moment, but it was stolen. Um, I was left unable to work. I was working two jobs when I got hit with um, MS and I was unable to work. We lived off 160 for months. I'm not even going to tell y'all. I made it. I made it through. Okay. I got through. You will get through whatever you're going through. You really, really will. You just have to keep that fight, keep that faith. And I'm not going to say I didn't have hard days. I had hard days. I fought depression real, real bad. Suicidal thoughts. I fought it all. I fought it all and I won. But guess what? I want to let y'all know it was necessary. It has changed me so much. On the it was something like this, baby. You see life totally different. You don't judge. You don't worry about the next. You focus on you. That's what you do. And that's what I continue to do. So I just want to encourage somebody on the day that it, it, it gets better. It gets better. And I'm not saying my life is perfect. Honey, we go through it. Okay? We have our days. Okay? Because like I said, in that finance department, I ain't that strong. But this health, I'm fighting it. And I have to remind myself, because I have those moments, just like everybody else. But I got to remind myself, after I'm done crying, I wipe them tears up. You know, after I'm almost falling and I get through that little shock, I got to remind myself, you know. But um, don't lose the faith. I just really wanted to let y'all know where I was, to let y'all know that I appreciate y'all. Lady of large, I love you to pieces. I don't even know you, okay. But I love you. You are very, very encouraging. And you know this fight. One on one, Lottie, Lottie, Kenny, thank you, thank you for your words, thank you, Karen, thank you for your words. No, it's not Karen. They've been on from the beginning, so I can remember their names. <laughs> but you know who you are. You got your own channel. I follow you, but you know who you are, and thank you for that. I really, really do. I, I, I thank you for that. I thank y'all for watching this channel. I thank y'all for keeping me encouraged, and I thank y'all for wanting to see how this battle roll out because it's not easy. But I have to do it. I'm a mom of three. I have to do it. I got to see my kids through. I got to see myself through. But I will let y'all know. I told my baby it's 20, 22. It's about me this year. I'm born into me. So I'm going to take care of myself a little bit better this year as I have not in the past. But y'all have a beautiful day. And guess what? I'm coming back with some awesome, awesome videos about MS and the things that I have noticed with my body with MS. So look forward to that. And if y'all haven't already looked at some of my videos, check them out. And check out some of them shorts because I like doing them.